Welcome back, ladies and germs. This is Batcraft Master coming at you with yet again another episode of Let's Build Hogwarts. This will be part 33. Now, in the last video, we had finished the Great Hall wall art and putting some last minute details here and there. There's still a couple things to do in there, but it's time to move on. We started the wall behind me, and there's one thing that was brought to my attention. I didn't tell you how far up this archway goes. But if you look, the empty part, the part you actually walk through, the top of it will actually go, will meet up with the top of the windows you have in here. You can see. Now, if you look up there, I've already did part of it, and I already put the windows in and did all that fun stuff. That's just so I can get my bearings of what we're going to do and all that fun stuff. So don't worry about that. I am going to walk it through, walk you through all of it. But what you want to do first is when you get to your archway your first one this because this is ten this is one two three four five six seven eight nine ten that's how wide your opening is now for the first block from the very top you're going to come down one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen then you're going to do two less than that on the next one two less than that on the next one on the next one, and on the next one. And the next one, you meet up with that, and then you do two more, then two more again, then two more again, then two more again. And then you'll have your full row again. So just like that. That's pretty much it. Then, what you want to do... Go to your windows. And four... This is counting one. One block above your window. Go up. One, two, three, four. At the fourth window... Take your stone, or the fourth block above your window, take stone bricks, and make a line going all the way across. Just like that. Alright. Now starting from the side over here, you'll come out straight too, and then you'll start going. But, starting with those two, right there, you're going to come... Two, those two right here, you're going to come down from that line one more block. Then you're going to skip one, and then come down another, an extra block on the next two. And then skip one, come down an extra block on the two, skip one. So what I mean is here we're skipping one. Boom, boom. We'll skip one. Boom, boom. Skip one. Put in two. 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 And so on and so forth. Pretty easy. Nothing too hard. Now, once you get that in, what you're going to do is you're going to fill these up all the way to the top of your wall. From the top of that line of stone bricks you put in, you're going to bring that all the way up to the very top of your wall. Alright, now that we have that brought all the way up to the top of our wall, you should have something that looks like this. There you go. Let me change it to daylight. There we go. Now what you need to do is you need to come and grab nether brick slabs. And underneath all of these blocks, you're going to put in one slab. Just as I am.
That way you get this look. It makes it a little more prominent. Now, what I want you to do is grab your stone bricks. And you're going to come up one extra brick on the next five, starting from the wall. So you have one, two, three, four, five. And you're going to skip three. One, two, three. And then do, come up an extra block on the next five. Skip three. Come up five. Skip three. Come up five. One, two, three, four, five. Skip three. One, two, three, four, five. Skip three. One, two, three, four, five. Skip three. And so on and so forth. Tops of those five, you came up, put on a slab of quartz. One quart slab. Just like so. that done and you'll have a space of three blocks empty in between these blocks of five that you went up one on the front portion on the front two the two that come out more you're gonna put a block of quartz down like that so it looks like this so you're putting one down you're skipping the back one and putting one down so we're putting one down we're skipping this back one and putting one down all right Now, once you get that done, you can have something that looks like this. Pretty good. Pretty good. Now, on that back one that we skipped while we're putting down our quartz slabs, that back one, you're going to grab your Arcadia wood slab, right? And you're going to put it down on that back one. Just like this. It should look like that. Alright? Then, Along the top, in the back, you're going to grab your Arcadia wood planks. As you can see, you're going to make a full row of one block of Arcadia wood planks. All the way across. Just underneath the quartz slabs on top of the blocks of five. So you should have something that looks like that. All right. Then, behind those, you're gonna come up. This. You're gonna put one down behind it, and then come up with it one, just like this, as I am doing. It should look like that. Now from behind that, from behind the top of that row, you're going to come up two. You're going to come behind it one and then come up two. It's easier to just come up one and then on your way back put an extra one on top. So as you can see I'm coming out. I'm going behind it once, coming up one. And then on my way back I'll put an extra one on top of those. Just like this. Just like that. So you should have something that looks like that. Alright, time to do it again. 
gonna come up you're gonna go behind it once and come up two you're gonna continue this pattern for a few times coming behind it once and then coming up twice once up twice so it should look like that now this twice nine more times and that will give us that'll get us to the top of the roof so seeing as you guys know what you're doing now I am going to fast forward this so we can get this roof done so we can get the other side of it done as well but I will walk you through the first portion of doing that. So here we go, guys. I'm going to fast forward, and I'll be right back with you guys.
there you have it, ladies and germs. There is the front of our roof done. Now, what you want to do is, starting from the top right here, skip the top one and go to the next line. And you're going to put one slab along the top of that one. So skipping what would be the very top of our roof, which is this row up here, going to the next one down, you're going to put one slab of Arcadia wood down on all of the all of the all of the ones below it. So on every single row of brick or blocks you have going, except for the very top and the very bottom, you're gonna put slabs down. Come on, bloody hell. That should be the last row you do. This one row that we did that was just one block, that's right below the quartz slabs, you're not putting a slab down. That's where you're going to stop. So it should look like that. Ladies and germs, that is the first half of our roof. That is the front. Done pretty darn well. Looks good. Looks very good. Now that we've got the front done, you're going to come down here, down yonder here to the bottom. You're going to grab your cobblestone. Alright. And from here, you're going to come out three. this flat portion right here and go four this one will be five and then you'll go four again five four four five four 
four, five, then four, and then five. That'll be five again, five again, then four, and then five, and then five again, five again. It'll be six this time. Six that time. Six this time. However many that is. And like that. Now from here, we're gonna put one like that. So this, is, so from the points coming out, you'll have one, two, three. That's what you want. That's what I mean by coming out by three. you want to grab your uh, stone bricks you're gonna make another row along the entire outside of this cobblestone you put down a row of stone bricks going all the way around it What you're going to do is you need to grab your block of quartz. And starting from your little corner right here, you're going to put a block down, and you're going to skip one, put a block, skip one block, skip one block, skip one block, and so on and so forth. You get the gist. At least I hope so. over yonder. That's right. Oh, I don't know how I'm going to do that.
put stairs facing like this in between. There we are. There we have it. Now, grab your nether brick fence. Also, grab your, where is it? Where is it? Your nether rack. Grab your flint and steel. And grab your dark oak trap doors. All right. Starting from the corner here, you're going to come up three. Put another rack on top of it and set it ablaze. And then put your trap doors along the top to make our torches. There we are. So then, now you're gonna go every 10 blocks, just like last time. Going 10 blocks, not counting the one the torch is sitting on. So if you're counting the one with the torch, it would be 11 blocks. So here, I'm not counting this one. Just starting on this one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. did and we'll count starting with the torch so that'll be one two three four five six seven eight nine ten three down so this will be one two three four five six seven eight nine ten one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten walk path around to here to our archway which is perfect we have a roof on the wall is done we are moving right on along guys this is gorgeous so let's see all right if you come to this side grab your Arcadia wood planks you'll put a road down along the bottom here Now, this row, you'll have to come down two more. These are stacks of three blocks.
just like that. All right. Now, after you get that row done, you need to do ten more of those rows. Ten more. And you just come along the bottom here, just like that. Make a row along that bottom one. go below it and bring it down two more blocks. so on and so forth as you guys get it all right but that's that's that part so you guys obviously can get it now hopefully so that will be your homework let's just bring the rest of this roof down you should have the front completely done so as long as you have the front done you can bring the roof down that's all. Now the back, this back wall, as you can see, I don't have any windows on or anything like that. I just have this portion on. So I started that just to give myself a little template of what we would be doing. That's probably going to change, but I'm still trying to find photographs of the inside. This is one big courtyard in here. There are four walls, like just like this one, there are four of these walls that come out. So, that's that, guys. We've gotten quite a bit done. We are moving right on along. Our Hogwarts is coming together quite nicely. We have a lot built. I mean, this it's pretty crazy to think we started with just a little teeny boathouse way down there. And now we have all this. But that's it for today's video ladies and germs I hope you guys enjoyed the video please please hit that like button let me know you're watching other than that in the next video we will be putting on there's a little tower that goes on this side so we are going to try and get that tower put in I'm going to try and find some photographs of the inside so we can get the inside wall down but other than that, we got this little tower to build over here, and then we have two little spires on top of this roof. But other than that, that is it for today's video. So, without further ado, this is Batcraft Master signing off. You guys have a great and glorious day. May God bless you, and we will see you next time. <laughs>